We are just three weeks away from the midterm elections and the fight for con congressional control is intensifying. We're here at the Smart Board to show where things stand right now, three weeks from Election Day. Let's begin with the Senate. Remember, for Republicans to take control of the Senate, they're going to need to pick up 10 seats. They're already way ahead in three seats currently held uh, by Democrats in, in Arkansas and in Indiana and in North Dakota. So for them to get control, they're going to have to win all six of these, these toss-up seats, which are in the yellow right here. All six of these toss-up seats in the yellow, plus one other seat now where Democrats are ahead. So for the Republicans to get control, they're going to have to sweep the board of the contested races and then win either Washington, California, or Little Delaware and Connecticut over here. That's what it's going to take for the Republicans to get control of the Senate. How about the House? Right now, the magic number in the House is 39. That's the number of seats Republicans would have to win to pick up in order to get control of the House. And what you see over here is the blue is held by Democrats now, red held by Republicans. The Republicans already starting to pick up seats. They're way ahead in seats now held by Democrats. So of the most competitive seats right now, those are the ones in the yellow right now, they're only going to have to win about half of them, about 20 six seats in order to get control. So that's where things stand right now. Three weeks to go until Election Day.